this first match was I knew I, I'm a big side L fan, you know, and yeah. so CM Punk, I think he's doing he looked he's getting looking better and better in the ring uh, every time. And and it's so so many different pairings that we're seeing, you know, from Darby to Hobbs to Daniel Garcia to Matt Seidel. Uh, this was, you know, definitely a respect level on there and that we had they had before the match and after the match. And I think yeah. they brought it. Um, you know, the pairing does so well on this. Um, the, the comfort level is looking great. Seidel looked like a million bucks, I think, in this match. I think this was one of his better singles matches in AEW to date. Yeah. Um, going to, against CM Punk, which is to him, you know, as he mentioned, pretty much just like a dream being across the ring from him as well. So AEW's full of dream making moments for sure. Um, making those dreams happen. This clobbering time, you know, a quick GTS to end it, but back and forth battle that was a lot of fun. And, you know, yeah. Feeding off the crowd, the pacing was well. It was commercial free. Look in my eyes, it's commercial free. Yeah, <laughs> sing it. I wish we could have that more often. Um, yeah, but but man, I'm with you with Seidel here. Uh, I thought he looked like a million bucks. He looked great. This is one of his mm -hmm. best singles performances. Um, even in a loss, unfortunately for him, but he he looked great. Right. There's times, man, where you know I didn't think CM Punk was going to lose this match, but there are times where man. Like Seidel was in control completely and yeah, it made it really fun. And I kept that same momentum. Um, like you said, from the, the buy-in, um, I think that this match was almost, uh, they needed to have this one immediately after that, keep that, that crowd hot. Um, and they were the whole time again, like the punch oh, yeah. chants were deafening. Um, and you know, they turned, they turned on Matt Seidel and everybody likes Matt Seidel. He's a nice guy. He smiles. He's a great guy. Mm -hmm. And like, everybody's booing him it's like oh come on guys he's he's gonna go out there and put on a show um but these guys delivered um i don't know how you can say that cm punk lost a step you know like he looks he looks great he looks like cm punk and he's wrestling like a guy who hasn't wrestled in seven years mm -hmm. and i think that's on purpose you know what i mean right. I, I don't know i it looks he looks like he's doing everything right he looks like cm punk i mean i loved cm punk back when he was in wwe and before that but it's like he looks like himself. He's wrestling yeah. the same. And I think that having these, these almost warm up matches for what he's going to be doing um, long-term in AEW is great. Uh, like mm -hmm. a guy against Matt Seidel, they're almost showing off like, okay, he can wrestle a young guy like Daniel Garcia. He can wrestle, you know, a veteran, another veteran who's, you know, in his forties, like Matt Seidel, who's a completely different style of wrestler. Um, and I think that it was kind of a showcase for both guys. Like, Hey, you know, punk punk can still go, and obviously yeah. they want to get those ratings and that rating battle. But you know, I I think it was more than that. I think like these guys are both great. Look at our roster; we got some of the best talent on the world, and oh yeah, we're gonna go out there and beat the hell out of each other. And they did that tonight. They did, and it was a respectful beatdown. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> the, the the handshake was great. They just guys just went to war with each other in the ring and were beating each other faces in, and then they're like, "Yep, that was awesome." <laughs> which it was. You, it was yeah it's yeah. it's like sometimes you know being a hockey fan you know fighting is part of the game yeah but also fighting is part of the respect of the game too you know sometimes there's a purpose but sometimes there's the purpose with respect at the end you're tapping the guy on the helmet on the back after you guys are throwing fists with each other so yep. to the respect the game but you know looking at you know punk's resume of matches who do you want to see him go against next you know what are like one or two opponents that you really want to see him go against that you know right off the bat yeah i'd love to see him uh wrestle ricky starks i think that would okay. be awesome yeah um, i want to see one. that uh, i want to see that team taz can stuff continue i think that's an interesting storyline um there's a sign did you see that sign punk fear is hook or something like oh, that no well we got to see we got to see hook in his in his aw in-ring debut against cm punk um, that needs to be his debut. Um, yeah. And it needs what to a be way a to start man, off. A 60 minute match, uh, Iron Man match or something crazy like that. Just get, send in hook, man. Um, another guy I like to see him wrestle. Uh, Ethan Page. Okay. <laughs> I like to see those promo battles before that. Um, mm -hmm. Obviously, they're going in a different direction right now, but I think that that would be a fun match. Uh, different styles. Love it. Uh, there you go. Yeah. Starks is all yeah, I can't wait. Yeah, I'm all for that Starks combo would sure. be great because of the, the body size and the Similar. charisma and the mic battles. And and I think it would be cool to have 
in some way or form, whether it be tag or solo, is like somewhere involved with the acclaim too, because you talk about mic yeah. battles, uh, oh, no. you know. So I think that would be a lot of fun for sure. So they could have CM Owens. Punk do a rap battle with uh, Max because <laughs> you could you could have great. CM Punk, you know, do a tag match. We'll see his first tag match against the acclaimed or something like that. You know, um, someone who have a partner with. I mean, obviously, it would have made sense for him yeah. to kind of partner with Darby like months ago, but now that Darby's kind of gone on on his way um I, right now there's no clear partner he's got he's you know a lone wolf yeah. right now uh so there's no one that maybe if for some reason like griff is hurt or something you could yeah. have you put you know brian that pillman and cool. cm punk together for something like that and one night only Can you imagine but, the pop for that team right oh, i know it would help put <laughs> pillman over even more as well he's so. already getting crazy love from the crowd